So, recently Facebook officially announced that it has found a security bug in its code which affected almost 50 million accounts. Now yeah, that's a pretty big number but what's worse is the bug itself. So let me get it straight, the security bug allowed anyone to log into anyone else's Facebook account which means I can simply log into Mark Zuckerberg's Facebook account without having to do anything complex. So what is this bug? How dangerous and how dumb is it? Well, if you guys don't know about the ViewVas tool on Facebook, it's basically a tool using which you can see how your profile looks from some other person's Facebook account so that you can customize your profile accordingly and you get to know how your profile looks from your friend's Facebook account. Now this feature is designed only as a ViewVas interface which means that it is designed only to let people know how their profile looks from another pe person's account. So it does not allow anything else than just viewing the profile. That is how it is designed by Facebook. This feature is existing from long back on Facebook and honestly I never used it any time because I don't know, I never found it useful. Anyways, so what happened is when you go and use the view as tool and select a specific person to view your profile, it displays a composer box where you can actually post stuff on Facebook. Now in this composer box there exists a component using which you can actually post birthday wishes to someone. This component of the composer incorrectly gave the user an option to actually post a video. So what's the big deal if you are given an option to post a video? Obviously this is not going to affect anyone because if you do post a video it is still posted on your timeline only. Well here is the catch. Facebook released a new version of its video uploader in 2017 and this video uploader when used with the view as option incorrectly and unintentionally generated the access token of the Facebook mobile app. But wait, it is not generating your Facebook access token here. It is actually generating the access token of the person who you are using to see your profile with the view as option. Which means if I'm using the view as option to see how my profile looks from Mark Zuckerberg's Facebook account, then I'm actually getting the access token of Zuckerberg's Facebook account. And I can simply find this access token in the HTML of the page because it is generated there by the video uploader. Of course, unintentionally. Well, and if you don't know what is meant by an access token, it is simply a string value using which you can log into your Facebook account without having to enter your username and password. So basically using an access token, you get access to a Facebook account without the password. So if I have the access token of Mark Zuckerberg's Facebook account, then I can log into his account without actually having to enter the password or username. I mean, isn't it quite shocking how a big company like Facebook had this dumb security bug? Like seriously, using this bug, anyone can get access to anyone else's Facebook account by just using the view as tool. Nothing else need to be done, just use the view as tool and you get the access token of anyone you wish and you can just get access into anyone's Facebook account. That is literally very 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 serious security bug and it's very dumb on behalf of Facebook as well. Now Facebook officially announced that it has actually discovered an external actor who has actually exploited this bug on Facebook. Which means that someone else has found this bug before Facebook did. Which is a bad thing. So anyways Facebook has now fixed this bug and it has also locked out people from their Facebook accounts to make sure that their old access token will be expired and can't be used anymore if in case their account is hacked using this security bug. So Facebook also did remove the view as tool temporarily and of course it has released a post on its newsroom. I will leave a link to that post in the description below so you can check it out. Alright, so if you guys have automatically been logged out from your Facebook account then do not worry. It's because Facebook is taking this security measure to protect its users from a bug which it has discovered like a week back and in order to make sure that no one else 
will be affected by the security bug anymore, it is actually logging out people from their Facebook accounts. And do you need to change your Facebook password after this incident? No, you do not need to actually change your Facebook password because even though if your access token is uh, taken by someone else, it doesn't reveal your password, which means once you log out from your Facebook account on your Facebook mobile app, then that access token which is stolen by the hacker or some person will get expired and it can't be used anymore and it doesn't reveal your password. So no, you don't need to change your password and this bug is fixed and it ends here, hopefully. Alright, so that is it for this video. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up below and if you don't like it, leave a thumbs down and also comment down below if you have any doubts regarding this video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more awesome videos. Cheers!